Ooh, stop doing that. Ooh, we're out of the way. Please don't set off the smoke alarm. Good Saturday. We're drinking. Okay, this is an unplanned. <laughs> stop yelling. Un oh, man. New ketchup. Just so you know, does not have high fructose corn syrup. It has sugar. Now it's high sugar. It's like a gram higher than some of the others, but no high fructose corn syrup. We're gonna be making a little cocktail sauce. What am I doing? We're just boiling some shrimp, man. Why? Hey, it's Saturday. We're drinking. I wasn't gonna make a video. Long story short, I'm boiling some water. I'll show you the pan in a minute. We're gonna boil some shrimp. Why? Here I am, 65 years old. I kind of avoid raw shrimp. It's easy to buy cooked shrimp. These shrimp have their legs and their tails. Oh, man. Oh, my God. How many are there? Two, four, six, eight. That's like 11. It's Saturday. We're drinking. And I'm 65 years old. I avoid frozen shrimp. I'm thinking, can you boil frozen shrimp? I Google it, and you can. Three or four minutes, put a lid on, just boil them. They're done. So if I didn't know how easy it was to boil shrimp, you might not know. And then I check on YouTube, and there are videos about boiling shrimp. And it's kind of funny, because you're just boiling the shrimp. This morning I watched a video where a woman put the shrimp into a cool pot of water, at uh, room temperature, put in some peppercorns, a little lemon juice. I'm not opposed to the lemon juice. Peppercorns are wasted. She puts them in a pot, room temperature brings it up to a little boil, and she says they're done. That's not enough time to get the benefits of the peppercorn. Maybe the lemon. I'm a little toasted. A couple weeks ago, I bought these frozen shrimp when I did the sidekicks video. Oh, what am I talking about? Oh, a couple weeks ago. Anyway, so the last uh, over the last couple of days, I've made a whole bunch of shrimp. The one thing I've learned is you've got to have a big enough pot of water to absorb some of the cold. Because the minute you put these in, that water's going to stop boiling. What I mean is the temperature is just going to drop. you got to be careful. We're going to put a lid on it, and these create a froth. If you're not careful, the pot could boil over, so you want to watch that. Cocktail sauce. It's just ketchup, horseradish, and lemon. That's it. It's easy. This is about a six-quart stock pot. So just remember, the bigger the pot, the less the heat will drop when you put in the frozen shrimp, because the frozen shrimp is going to kill the rolling boil. I have no room in my kitchen. I'm moving stuff around. I think we're good. Rolling boil. There you go. We're going to put the lid on. Just watch it. You don't want it to froth over. Four minutes. And go. Pretty simple. If you have ice water, drop them in ice water. We're going to run them under tap. Then they're going to go in the fridge to chill while we make our cocktail sauce. Who's been drinking? Where's the kitchen? Uh, where's the kitchen? Where is it? I washed it. When you drink it. Cheers, it's Saturday. A minute to go. You don't want it to froth over. Watch the froth. I should have known that you could just easily boil frozen shrimp. Done. Lay off. Don't waste your pepper. My kitchen widget comes in handy. Cold water. Until they're cool. You don't want them to keep cooking. Ice water is a good thing if you have it. Going in the fridge to chill. Chill! Hey! Woo. Cheers, it's Saturday. This is brand new ketchup, so you want to shake it? Horseradish. Put in as much as you want. I actually bought cocktail sauce. Once I learned that this was so easy. You have to add lemon. You gotta have a little lemon. There you go. That looks good. Oh, that's so good. Put that in the fridge. We're gonna wait for the shrimp to cool and we'll be back. Peel these very easy. Grab it. Peels the legs off with the skin. Roll it around. And then you can just pull the tail off. Sometimes there's still a little veins, so you gotta check these pre-frozen shrimp. Just grab and pull. Grab an edge, roll, and pull. Boiled shrimp, cocktail sauce, cooked through. Mmm. Mmm. That's so good. If I knew it was this easy years ago, I wouldn't have been buying the cooked shrimp. It really is easy. Mmm. I used to make this cocktail sauce for my father. He loved buying the cooked shrimp. And he loved eating shrimp. Mm. Thank you for joining me this Saturday. You know what I'm going to say.